Garth Tander is once again looking to make history as he heads into this weekend's Bathurst 1000, drawing inspiration from his past triumphs. The seasoned driver is keenly reminded of his remarkable victory in 2011 when he teamed up with a then-rookie Nick Percat. Together, they not only conquered the grueling race, but also secured the prestigious Peter Brock Trophy, marking a significant milestone in Tander's illustrious career. Fast forward to the present, and Tander, now 47 years old, is embracing a new challenge in the form of young talent Matt Payne. This partnership signals a shift from his recent collaborations with veteran drivers, as Tander has previously raced alongside stars like Shane Van Gisbergen, winning the great race in both 2020 and 2022, and finishing fifth with David Reynolds last year. Transitioning from Grove Racing's number 26 Mustang to the number 19, Tander aims to make a strong statement with Payne, who has already proven himself as a rising star in the Supercars Championship. Notably, Tander and Payne achieved a commendable fourth-place finish in the recent Sandown 500, positioning them as a formidable duo as they gear up for the 161 laps of the iconic Mount Panorama circuit. Reflecting on his previous experience with young co-drivers, Tander optimistically states, The last time I teamed up with a young driver at Bathurst, it was Nick Percat in 2011, and we won that one, so hopefully, lightning strikes twice. In discussing his new teammate, Tander expresses excitement about sharing the track with the talented 22-year-old New Zealander. Payne, known for his relaxed demeanor and remarkable speed, has quickly made his mark in the supercars arena. Tander is genuinely impressed by Payne's skills, noting, he can do things in a race car I couldn't do at that age, so I'm really excited to be sharing the car with Matt and helping him on his journey. Despite being only 22 and having two Supercars Championship victories under his belt, Payne's racing journey is just beginning, as he wasn't even born when Tander claimed his first Bathurst 1000 win back in 2000, alongside Gary Rogers Motorsport and Jason Barguana. As Tander prepares for this weekend's race, he is not just focused on his own performance, but is dedicated to mentoring Payne, guiding him through the complexities of the Bathurst experience. The partnership is rooted in mutual respect, and Tander's wealth of experience will be invaluable for the young driver. With the atmosphere buzzing with anticipation, fans and competitors alike are eager to see how Tander and Payne will perform on the legendary Mount Panorama. The stage is set for an exhilarating race, and with Tander's hopes high and his sights set on glory, one can't help but feel the thrill of possibility. Whether lightning strikes twice for Tander and Payne remains to be seen, but their combined talents and determination could very well make for an unforgettable Bathurst 1000. Stay subscribed for more videos.